is obviously not a sufficiently good answer to say, well, all this exists because it was willed into existence merely by some kind of deity. But it's reasonable to then ask the question, well, what's the origin of the deity? Has the deity existed forever? Has the universe existed forever? So I think just seeing signs of that, that, that kind of thinking, which is really what you might say, the, the, the prerequisite or the first signs of a scientific way of thinking. The scientific approach acknowledges that if we're ever going to ask grand questions like why are we here, we have to begin with how. In, in my view, science is a, a, a humble pursuit. It starts by asking very simple questions. Ask questions like, why is it that when you let something go, it falls to the ground, and let it go, falls to the ground again, falls to the ground again. You observe regularities in nature, tiny, small regularities, and try and explain them, model them, understand them. Through that process, we've been led to uh, an intellectual framework that maybe allows us to answer questions about the very origin of reality itself.